Hi, little Isaac. Well, I'm waiting for this to upload, so while I'm do waiting for that, I thought, I'll read you another book. Of course, I do realize that could result in an infinite loop, because then I'll be waiting for this one to upload, and I'll read another, and another, and another, and another. But eventually, the cats will remind me that they haven't eaten yet, so we're, we're, we're not going to do that. Well, we've had quite a long stretch of a lot of wet weather, a lot of wet weather. There'll probably be less honey this year, because... I think during the major honey flow, the bees weren't out and about as much because the weather was wet. For me, it's not quite as big of a thing because I'm starting a new hive, but um, it's quite interesting how th this all works. But rain is good too. So this is a book about rain, In the Rain with Baby Duck. Well, this looks quite nice. Looks like that's a mom duck and a baby duck and an umbrella duck and duck boots. Let's see what's, oh, that's a rabbit. It's not a duck, that's a rabbit ears, looks like, but whatever. It's beautiful. Written by Amy Hess, illustrated by Jill Barton. No front art here, just mustard yellow, which is nice too. In the rain with baby duck. You have a duck sitting at the window, looking out, seemingly a bit forlorn that he or she cannot go outside and play. But it's fun to play in the rain, too. That should be a duck. Pit-pat, pit-a-pat, pit-a-pat-a-pat. Yes, pit-pat-a-pat. Oh, I did it right. Oh, the rain came down. It poured and poured. Baby Duck was mad. She did not like walking in the rain. But it was Pancake Sunday. Duck family tradition and baby loved pancakes and she loved grandpa who was waiting on the other side of town. Pit-a-pat, 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 pit-a-pat. Follow us, step lively, Mr. and Mrs. Duck left the house arm in arm. Wet feet, well, baby, don't dally, dear. Don't drag behind, called Mr. Duck. Why do they always tell children that? Don't dally. Don't lag behind. They have littler legs. Wet face, pouted baby. Water in my eyes. Mrs. Duck pranced along. See how the rain rolls off your back. Mud, muttered baby. Mud, mud, mud. Don't dawdle, dear. Don't lag behind. Mr. and Mrs. Duck skipped along. They waddled. They shimmied. It's hard to read backwards. They hopped in all the puddles. Baby dawdled. She dallied and pouted and dragged behind. Beautiful pictures again. They do such nice pictures in these books. Everyone is different, but everyone, really everyone is wonderful. She sang a little song. I do not like the rain one bit, splashing down my neck, baby feathers soaking wet. I do not like this mean old day. Are you singing? called Mr. and Mrs. Duck. What a fine thing to do in the rain. Baby stopped singing. So baby duck does not like the rain. Grandpa was waiting at the front door. He put his arm around Baby. Wet feet, he asked. Yes, said Baby. Wet face, Grandpa asked. Yes, said Baby. Mud, Grandpa asked. Yes, Baby said. Mud, mud, mud. That's a nice Grandpa. I'm afraid the, bane, the rain makes baby cranky, clucked Mr. Duck.
I've never heard of a duck who doesn't like rain, worried Mrs. Duck. Is that a fact? Grandpa kissed Baby's cheeks. Grandpas are great. Uh, grandmas, too. And grums. Don't even get me started. Well, you can get me started, because that's the whole point. I love you. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to cost you mention. Grandpa took Baby's hand. Come with me, Baby. They went upstairs for, to the attic. We are lucky, looking for a tall green bat, said Baby. I mean, said Grandpa. Tall green bat. Do you see a tall green bat in the attic? I think I do. Finally, they found it. Inside was a beautiful red umbrella. There were matching boots, too. These used to be your mother's, Grandpa whispered, a long time ago. She was a baby duck who did not like rain. Baby opened the umbrella. The boots were just the right size. Oh, I forgot to show you that. I don't know if you know, but you've got to see it, too. Want to be sure that it was on or taking care of her stuff. Baby and Grandpa marched downstairs. My boots, cried Mrs. Duck, and my bunny umbrella. No, mine, said Baby. You look lovely, said Mrs. Duck. You look lovely, and she does. Mrs. Duck, Mr. Duck put a platter of pancakes on the table. After that, she likes her boots. We'll get you rain boots, and if you want to have there they are, little bunnies, we will get that. Let me know. They, they probably make all kinds of boots. I mean, we know they do, but they probably even make some with little bunny rabbits in baskets like that. After that, Baby and Grandpa went outside. Pit-pat, pit-a-pat, pit-a-pat. Pit-a-pit-a-pat. I got it now. Okay, got the rain sounds. Pit-pat, pit-a-pat, pit-a-pit-a-pat. Oh, the rain came down. It poured and poured. Baby Duck and Grandpa walked arm in arm in the rain. They waddled. They shimmied. They hopped in all the puddles. I like this book. And Baby Duck sang a new song. I really like the rain a lot, splashing my umbrella. Big red boots on baby feet. I really love this rainy day. This baby duck is almost as good at making songs as I am. Wait a second. Why don't they ever say the end? I guess that's the end. Well, I think we better sing the song better than that because... It was, I just sort of mostly read it, so let me sing it. I don't know if we'll sing it the same exact voice as what we have here. I really like the rain a lot, splashing my umbrella. Big red boots and baby feet, I really love this rainy day. Rainy day, rainy day, rainy day, rainy day. Splish, splash, splish, splash, I really love this rainy day. I added the last part, in case you couldn't tell. But we don't know for sure if that's how they meant it. Maybe she meant it, I don't know, a different way. I really like the rain a lot, splashing my umbrella. Big red boots on baby feet. I really love this rainy day. 
I really love this rainy day. Maybe that's how she meant it. Gabby's getting a little impatient with my singing this song, but hmm. let's see. What the hell are they? Look at them splashing. I really like the rain a lot. Splashing my umbrella. Big red boots and belly feet. I really love this rainy day. Could be that's how she meant it. That's another way of saying it. How about country music? And the twang? I don't know. I haven't practiced twanging in a while. Hmm, made in my head. How did they, you know, they get that thing in their voice. Oh, well, I better just, I better just keep trying something else. How about if I, how about if I wrap it? That's what we do with our hands. I don't know. I don't know, something like that. <laughs> I forgot my wrapping skills. I really like the rain a lot. Splashing my umbrella. Big red boots on baby feet. I really love this rainy day. I don't think that was the rap just between you and me in the world. Um, I'm, I'm trying to think of other ways to sing. But, oh, I sang a country song once called Floyd. Floyd was a good man. He showered on Tuesdays, something like that. Uh, anyway, the baby duck likes the rain now because she has a very wise grandpa and he he really enjoys the rain with his baby baby granddaughter too and we have already taken you in the rain and it is fun and we'll be doing more of it and if you come visit we'll be doing plenty because it don't seem to shine around here these days but it will don't worry okay one last version i suppose i don't know um I'm just thinking here, and it's not good to think. You're watching the side of my face thinking. That's not that much, that much fun. Just trying to hear other ways of singing it in my head. But I think this is going to be the last one, whatever I do, because it's getting a little annoying, isn't it? Um, I really like the rain a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Splashing my umbrella, la 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 la. Big red boots on baby feet, baby feet, baby feet, baby feet, baby feet. I really love this rainy day, 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 day. Rain, rain, rain on a rainy day. Rain, rain, rain on a rainy day. I love this rainy day. It touches my soul. It touches my heart. When she got scared. It touches my soul. It touches my heart. It touches my being. My very being. I really love this rainy day. And now I'm going to go off and love this rainy day. I love you to bits, sweetie pie. I love you so much. You have a great day, and may your day be filled with beautiful music and glorious raindrops or bright sunshine. I love you, little guy. Lots of love, whatever you do. Okay, bye-bye.